The president of the Lagos Chamber of Commons and Industry, LCCI, Gabriel Dahosa, has charged the creative community on the importance of managing both talents and finances in the rapidly growing entertainment and fashion sectors. Speaking during the Pan-African 10th Annual Music Fashion Runway Media Briefing, Idahosa highlighted the need for creatives to move beyond artistic brilliance and adopt a more strategic approach to their careers. The LCCI president stressed that many creatives often struggle with monetizing their craft and managing the business aspects of their careers, which can lead to financial instability or even burnout. Drawing from his experience in both the private sector as a leader of the LCCI, he urged the audience to invest in their personal and professional development beyond their craft. The management of your finances must be as good as your singing, your, your singing talent. The management of your business must be as good as your skill or the quality of what you do as, as a fashion model. So that is why we want to continue to work with the creative industry. We need to continue to remind everyone in the creative industry that you are as good as the ecosystem around what you do. Because a lot of us in the creative industry probably started as, as a passion. I just like to sing. I just like to make clothes. I just like to, you know, just act in the play. You just, you just like it. You didn't go out to say, I, I, I want to do a job as a singer. Chairperson of the Creative and Entertainment Group, LCCI, Dr. Ngozi Omambala, emphasized that technology is key in pushing the creative sector forward. Dr. Omambala pointed out that the Nigerian creatives have already made significant strides on the global stage, but noted that the sector's full potential could only be realized if technology were fully integrated into the way creatives work or creative work is produced, shared, and monetized. Some runway models and their coaches also spoke on some of the behind the scenes which make up the glitz and glamour of the event. Um, I've just come back from a trip. You know, Mr. Mr. Um, President kindly nominated me to, to represent him. And it was a real eye-opener again, having gone to Taiwan and seeing how the country flawlessly works with sustainability practices, and um, renewable energy to push its country forward. No, it's no surprise to them that they're number one when it comes to renewables, petrochemicals, and consumer goods. And I really want to see um, our creative sector really adopt some of these practices so that we too can be as efficient and um, as you know, hardworking as they are in, in making ourselves number one you know, in the pedestal too. Nigeria has some of the most stunning talents, beauties, and models in the world. So from all of these talents, selecting the ones who would be on the show, it's a whole lot of work. But you want not just the beauty, you want professionalism. You want those who are bringing something extra to the table, like uh, Philip rightly said. You want those who can also put the designs out there. Because a, a fashion designer who has put in so much work to come up with um, a design, for those designs to come to life, there's a look. So it's just like you producing a movie. For young stars who are looking to go into modeling, they shouldn't just look at gaining the spotlight of working the runway, working with fashion designers. They should ask themselves questions like, if I decide to be a model, what additional value am I going to give? as I'm going to photo shoots, as I'm going for fashion runways, and I'm being booked, right? What do I have to give extra in terms of my skill set? Do I just have to go to the photo shoots just to take pictures, or after pictures, can I help these businesses gain enough sales and publicity? My struggle in the industry was having to talk to my parents to allow me school and at the same time model in the industry. So it was like a, like a big struggle for me. But I had to put it out there to them that, oh, this is really what I want to do. So they told me that if I'm to model, I have to, you know, go to school and then pass my, my courses, of which I did. 
Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.